Sunday morning service at the Baptist Tabernacle. 欢迎大家观看洛杉矶市中心祭祖会幕，礼拜天早上的礼拜。Let's go! 我们各部的文件那个怎么那个 logo 披萨。Thank you for watching on our pastor's website and on YouTube. We are so glad to have you with us. Every month we get the statistics for how many people watch our sermons on our pastor's website. Every month we get the statistics for how many people watch our sermons on our pastor's Cada mes miramos los números de cuánta gente mira el sitio internet. And last month we had one very interesting figure. 上个月呢有很有意思的一个统计数字。Mes pasado un número muy interesante. Last month in the Vatican City, Holy See, more than a hundred different people watch these sermons on our pastor's website. Now the Vatican City and the Holy See is where the Pope and his cardinals live. 而上个月呢，就是在梵蒂冈城里面，就是教皇住的地方，和他的红衣主教，总共有一百零二个呃独立的电脑来读讲。Mes pasado, a más de cien gente en el Vaticano miró de este sitio internet. The only people that are allowed to live there are priests and nuns and high-ranking officials of the Catholic Church. 唯一就在那里面，就是那个天主教最高层那些啊，他他们那红衣主教。Solo oficiales de la Iglesia Católica viven ahí. And from the Vatican City, Holy See, more than 100 different people looked at our pastor's website, sermonsfortheworld.com. 就是从梵蒂冈里边，他们就教皇住地方，有超过一百多个人读到了我们讲道，观看我们视频。This is the one that read in the Vatican. What the same hand that we know, Allah, the sheet of the head of number seven. And last month we had more than 120,000 different people watch and look at the website sermonsfortheworld.com. 而且在我们 sermonsfortheworld.com 这个网站上面，上个月超过了十二万多点点击的读者。我们不少都买的新书，跟着你的说呢，你都去跟着嘞。Why don't you send Dr. Heimers an email? His email is already at the top of the screen right now. His email is already at the top of the screen right now. His email is already at the top of the screen right now. Be sure to put down what country you are writing from when you write to him. When you write to him, write down the country you are writing from. Escribe del país donde estás escribiendo cuando escribas. Dr. Heimers gets emails from all over the world, and he reads and responds to every email that he gets. Hi, 博士从世界各地都能够收到电邮，而且他会每封电邮都有回信。Dr. Heimers receives emails from all parts of the world, and he responds to them. So send Dr. Heimers an email. His email is already at the top of the screen. Be sure to put down what country you are writing from when you write to him. Now, the address is now at the top of the screen. Now, in just a moment, you will have the opportunity to hear our pastor, Dr. Heimers, preach. 再过几分钟，我们牧师给我们讲道。Momento tendrá la oportunidad para escuchar lo que Heimers predica. Now, Dr. Heimers is an incredible man. On Friday, I spent the whole day with him at the Nixon Library. 在礼拜五，我们去尼克松总统啊图书馆那里度过一天。把身边带到了比罗德克的啊尼克松公园。And he is a great friend of mine. Listen carefully. He has wisdom and experience, and he knows what he's talking about. Listen carefully as he comes to preach. But first, Mr. Griffith will come to sing for us. Revive thy work, O Lord, thy mighty arm make bare. Speak with the voice that wakes the dead and make thy people hear. Revive, revive, and give refreshing showers. The glory shall be all thine own. The blessing shall be ours. Aviva nos, refresca nos, Señor. La gloria para ti será nuestra la bendición. Revive thy work, O Lord. Disturb this sleep of death. 
quick and the smoldering embers now by thine almighty breath. Revive, revive, and give refreshing showers. The glory shall be all thine own, the blessing shall be ours. Revive thy work, O Lord, create soul thirst for thee. But hungering for the bread of life, oh, may our spirits be. Revive, revive, and give refreshing showers. The glory shall be all thine own. The blessing shall be ours. We're glad to have you all with us this morning. And and the Pope watching on YouTube, amen. We have actually had, uh, we've actually had conversions of, of scholars in the Catholic Church. The man in Pakistan who translates our sermons into Urdu was a lifelong Roman Catholic. After translating my sermons for about uh, six months, he became a born again Baptist. So we're hoping that the Pope will become a Baptist. And I want you to come back tonight at 6.15. 希望今晚六点十五分回到我们身边。Because this young man that just led the music and all is a tremendous preacher. And I want you to hear John Samuel Kagan tonight preaching without God. Be sure to come back tonight. We have dinner for you and everything here. So John Samuel Kagan from the God. Was a grand predicable. Now this morning I want you to turn in your Bible to the 64th chapter of Isaiah. Isaiah 64, it's on page 700-768 in the Schofield Study Bible. Isaiah 64, verse 1. Oh, that thou wouldest rend the heavens. That thou wouldest come down. That the mountains might flow down at thy presence. You may be seated. When God comes down, the mountains flow down at his presence. Mountains of unbelief flow down. Mountains of doubt flow down. Mountains of pride. Mountains of despair. Mountains of selfishness. Mountains of satanic oppression flow down. When God comes down in a church. All mountains that stand against our God and his Christ flow down when the Spirit of God comes into a church in power. That the mountains might flow down like molten lava from a volcano at the presence of God. Oh, 
Levanten los hombres como el agua en presencia de Dios. Real revival prayer means taking hold of God and not letting go. 真正为复兴做的祷告就是抓住神的虚平，不轻易让他离开。Ahora son de bien en todas agarrando a Dios, no soltando. As did Jacob when he wrestled all night with Christ in prayer. 正如雅各在通宵祷告中间与基督做的事情一样。Tal como hizo Jacob cuando luchó con el Cristo toda la noche. When Jacob said, "I will not let thee go except thou bless me." 雅各这样讲，你不出给我祝福的话，我就不容你去。Dejo no te deje ir, menos que me bendigas. The great preacher, Dr. Martin Lloyd Jones, said that revival prayer is taking hold of God. 伟大的宣道士钟马田医生这样讲，做复兴做祷告呢，就是抓住神的视听。Lloyd Jones dijo de que la oración es agarrando Dios, pleading with Him, 祈求他。Reasoning with him, even beseeching him, and I say that it is only when a Christian arrives at that position that he truly begins to pray. I say, when you reach this position, you are the one who begins to pray. That's the only thing that you can do. That's the only thing that you can do. That's the only thing that you can do. But revival praying must come from men like Isaiah. 但为复兴做祷告，必须来自像以赛亚这样的人。Oración de viento viene de hombre tal como Isaías. Men who say with the prophet, "Here am I, send me." 他能与先知一同这样讲说，我在这里，请差遣我。Hombre que diga me envía, me envía, me envía. Men who are willing to sacrifice their lives in the service of God and His Christ. 那些为了侍奉神能够愿意献出性命的人。Hombre dispuesto a sacrificar la vida en el servicio de Dios. Dr. A. W. Tozer said, "If Christianity is to stay alive, she must have men again." Tozer 博士指出，如果基督教想继续生存的话，他必须有一群男子汉。Tozer 你说谁来跟你讲大话？别别别来跟那些 hombres. But they must be the right kind of men. 但他是必须有真正的一群正确的人。El tipo correcto de hombre. She must repudiate the weaklings who dare not speak out. 那些教会必须谴责那些不敢说话的懦夫。Tiene que repudiar a los débiles. She must seek men of the stuff that prophets and martyrs are made of. 她必须寻找那些具有先知与烈士心肠的人。Tiene que buscar hombres hechos de materia de parte de profetas. He said they will be men of God and men of courage. 他们将是神的子民，有勇气十足的人。Hombre de Dios, hombre de valor. And through their prayers and labors, God will send the long delayed revival. Unquote, Doctor Tozer. 通过他们的祷告与劳苦，神会遣下那姗姗来迟的复兴。Oh, the better Lord, I show you about God's mandate of your ministry. That is what our church needs at this hour. Man of God and man of courage. 神的子民，勇气十足。Hombres de Dios, hombres de valor. We need men and women who have seen the vanity of this world. 我们需要能看穿世间虚荣的男女。那是他们 hombre y mujeres que han visto la vanidad del mundo. Young men and women who want sacrifice rather than security. 那些敢于献身，哦，可以勇于忽略人生安稳。Eso que quieren sacrificio en vez de seguridad. Men and women that are free from fear. 那些无所畏惧的人。Men and women who will say with the prophet, "Here am I, send me." 并能同先知这样讲，我在这里，请差遣我。Young men and women who pray from the depths of their soul, "Oh, that thou wouldst rend the heavens." 那些能从心底这样呼喊道，愿你裂天而降。Oh, that thou wouldst come down. 愿上帝的面前震动。As when the melting fire burneth, 好像火烧干柴。Come on, fire, come on, so don't get burned. The fire causes the waters to boil. 路上火将水烧开。Why don't God send the fire to make thy name known to thine adversaries? 使你敌人知道你的名。That the nations may tremble at thy presence. Young people, rise up and give your lips to that prayer.
，年轻人站起来，用你的双唇激励他们做出这样的祷告。How many take yes? Be loud and strong. With zeal and with power. 充满激情这样去祷告。Don't let us go down. Young people, rise up and sacrifice your peace. 年轻人站起来为基督放放弃你的安宁。And sacrifice your prosperity. 你的富裕。Sacrifice the prosperity and sacrifice your very lives for Jesus Christ, the Son of God. 为耶稣基督生儿子，放弃甚至你的性命。Sacrifice the peace of Christ for Jesus. Young people, rise up and fight the devil and his demons with all your strength and prayer. 年轻人兴起吧，靠祷告与魔鬼之势力竭力去争斗。For God's glory to come down in our church in a mighty shower of revival. 祈求神的荣耀在复兴中降临到我们教会。Father, give your blessing and in power in the building. Onward, Christian soldiers! That's number one. Say it. Stand and say it. Onward, Christian soldiers, marching as to Young people, I have been young too. 年轻人，我也曾年轻过。How many of you have been young? But now I'm old. 但我现在老了。All that thing with that. So are some of the leaders of our church. 而且在座的些领导也是老了。但明阿公若 leader their class. We led this church through the long and weary years of the church split. 我们带领的教会通过了漫长的疲惫岁月。Yeah, Mahatma Gandhi gave us the mantle. We sacrificed our time. 我们牺牲了自己的时间。Sacrificamos el tiempo. Our money. 我们金钱。El dinero. And the years of our youth. 而且我们的青春。Nuestra juventud. To make this church as good as it is. 使这间教会走到了如今。Para ser la iglesia grande como es. And it is quite good. 这是一群相当好的会众。Yes, bueno. It cost us. 付出了代价。Costó. It cost us hours of agony. We had many hours of those long agonies. The loss of friends. 还见朋友失去。Bad days of the migos. The crucifixion of our lives. 我们生命被钉上十字架。The crucifixion of our lives. We paid the price. 付出了代价。We paid for the worldwide ministry this church has on the internet. We paid for the worldwide ministry this church has on the internet. And the many unprecedented works of this church. And the many unprecedented works of this church. And the many unprecedented works of this church. But we no longer have the dew of youth upon our brows. We no longer have the stamina to take this church to the next level. We no longer have the vigor and vitality or the volition to lead this church to the next level. We no longer have the vigor and vitality or the volition to lead this church to the next level. We no longer have the vigor and vitality or the volition to lead this church to the next level. We no longer have the vigor and vitality or the volition to lead this church to the next level. We no longer have the vigor and vitality or the volition to lead this church to the next level. We no longer have the vigor and vitality or the volition to lead this church to the next level. We no longer have the vigor and vitality or the volition to lead this church to the next level. We no longer have the vigor and vitality or the volition to lead this church to the next level. We no longer have the vigor and vitality or the volition to lead this church to the next level. We no longer have the vigor and vitality or the volition to lead this church to the next level. We no longer have the vigor and vitality or the volition to lead this Though we are still active, we no longer have the power to create the new, new Baptist Tabernacle. 虽然我们仍在宣道，但是我们不再有这个能力去打造全新的新进行会幕。No tenemos la fuerza para hacer la nueva, nueva Tabernacle Baptista. You young people must do it, or it will not be done. 你们年轻人必须接班教去做，不好，不可能办到。Oh, can I, 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 can
，这样去说，阿斯拉，有嘞，就这样去说，阿斯拉。I was once a fiery young pastor. 我曾经是一个火热的年轻牧师。On the day of Pastor Hoven, I could once preach three times every Sunday with electrifying polemics. 有那么一个礼拜天，我可以三次这个雷鸣电闪的宣道。For the ability God to bless the day of the fourth day, I could hold the attention of a thousand people and four hundred of them. First-time visitors when I was young. 当我年轻的时候，有一千多人，其中有四百人第一次来访那些，抓住他们的注意力。Agarraba la atención de mil personas de la vez cuatrocientos de ellos nuevos. But I find now that I am an old man of seventy-six years and a cancer survivor. 但我现在年纪大了，七十六岁，而且得了癌症幸存下来。Pero ahora sesenta y seis años de eso he vivido cáncer. I'm too old for that. After long meditation and prayer, I know that we cannot wait any longer. 通过长期的斟酌祷告，我不能再等待下去了。Después de meditación, oración, sé que no podemos esperar. And I say that we need to begin transferring our leadership to young people now, while there's still time for us to stay and help you. Now is the time to transfer leadership. 我看我们现在就需要把我们领导权。教会领导教给我们年轻人的下一代人，等我们能够作为他们的监督，作为他们的向导。可以吗？可以吗？大家一起来说。好，那我们后面的年代就等到我们这一代。Next year, next year, I will have been in the ministry for sixty years. Sixty years. 明年春季我传道已经六十年了，整整六十。El próximo año tendré sesenta años en el ministerio. You may not know it, but very few pastors are still preaching after 60 years of service. 可能你不知道，经过六十载的侍奉，很少有传道士仍然在担任牧师。Ya no lo sabe, pero poco más tarde predican después de sesenta años de servicio. I don't even think Dr. Criswell did he did he doctor go there six, did he preach six years? Even the great Criswell from Dallas First Baptist did not preach for 60 years. He wanted to, but he couldn't. 甚至连达拉斯的有名的 Chris Ware 博士，他也没有宣六十年道。I'm Chris Ware, grande da tratado, pero no pudo dar sesenta años. I feel, however, that the time has come for me to step aside to be a guide rather than a leader. 但我感到现在是我交班做向导的时候了。Therefore, I propose that the young man who led the beginning of this service, John Samuel Kagan, should be ordained to the ministry and should become the pastor of our church. Time I will step back and become his guide and his mentor as the pastor emeritus of our church. Johann, 担任牧师之后呢，我就退后一步，成为他的向导。Set up the plan for my pastor emeritus of the church. I further propose that Noah Song be licensed to the gospel ministry the same night that John is ordained. 我进一步提议，立上天理为执事，在这同天。And that Aaron Yancey, Jack Nang, and Abel Prudhomme and Chu Dong Lee be ordained as deacons to our church at that time. 同时，那一天呢，任命的亚伦、杨希、杨国辉和亚伯·普鲁通先生作为我们的执事，叫李培东先生。Mr. Kitamian, Aaron Yancey, Jack Nang, Abel Prudhomme. And that Aaron Yancey be given the permanent title of chairman of the deacons. Deacon 受亚伦·杨希与执事主席的永久职称。The Aaron Yancey shall double the title of permanent as the president of the deacons. We will then adopt and add to our constitution a new system. 然后我们通过一个新的我们的一个制呃制度。Pondremos un sistema nuevo en la constitución. Making five of these Good men, active deacons, 
on a rotation basis in our church. Now is the time for us to seize the moment and pass the torch of our ship church to younger men. And they must lead us to become the new, new Baptist Tabernacle. Onward, Christian soldiers, the second stanza at the sign of triumph. I know by 60 years of experience. I was a 17-year-old boy. Easter Sunday morning. And the pastor said something he had never said before. He said, I feel that there is a young man here who should give his life to the preaching of the gospel. When he said that, I thought that that's, he's talking to me. I left my seat and walked to the front of the church and shook hands with him. And from that moment in the early spring of 1958, from that moment until now, I have known that I had to be a Baptist preacher. And yet I know by 60 years of experience that our youth, that our youth, Alone cannot accomplish this. We must have fresh oil. An outpouring of God's Spirit is what we need, or it cannot be accomplished. Dr. Timothy Lin, Dr. Timothy Lin was my pastor for 24 years in the Chinese Baptist Church. Dr. Timothy Lin was my mentor and my teacher. Dr. Lin was a mighty man of prayer. Dr. Lin had a grand hombre de oración. And Dr. Lin said the goal of prayer is to have the goal of prayer is to have God's presence. Lin Without God's presence, all efforts will be futile and unsuccessful. Sir, 
Satan, Satan knows, Satan knows, Satan knows that our church will not grow without the power of God's presence. 如果没有神的力量与我们同在，他说：“撒旦知道我们不会成长。”撒旦那上面的格里格里西诺瓦格里圣经的本身就是 Dios。That we will go around in the circle in our circle of activities during the week。我们会就不断的徒劳做工。把我们跟点外头把很多那什么呢 ？Bringing in some guests。把那些人带进来。Others not coming back. We can go on that wheel like a squirrel running on a wheel in a cage, and we can go on in that circle year after year after year, not realizing that we haven't added a single person. 结果我们可以一年接一年这样打圈子，兜圈子下去，没有加多一个人。Until we sit down one time and look at the statistics and say to ourselves, "We've had all that work and it's all been a failure." 结果我们看一下我们数字，知道我们全部都浪费了。Pero cuando se mira los números verá de que todo ese trabajo dirá fracaso. And Satan will have won the way. 结果撒旦打赢了这个战役。For he is the one that does not want the church to grow. And my pastor, Dr. Lin, said, "The closer we are to the second coming of Christ, the greater Satan's pressure will be against prayer." Lin 到来之后，我们越是接近耶稣基督第二次回归的时候，撒旦压迫力量越大。The apostle, the apostle Paul said, "We wrestle not against flesh and blood." 使徒保罗说，我们不是属那个属于血气的征战。保罗说，我们不是属于血气的征战。Our warfare is against Satan and his demons. 那是与撒旦与其爪牙征战。Nuestra lucha es contra Satanás y los demonios. But we ask ourselves, how can we wrestle against the powers of darkness? 我们问这个问题，如何与黑暗势力征战？ And Paul gave the answer. Paul gave the answer. Praying always with prayer and supplication in the Spirit. Pray always with prayer and supplication in the Spirit. Pray always with prayer and supplication in the Spirit. Pray always with prayer and supplication in the Spirit. Pray always with prayer and supplication in the Spirit. Pray always with prayer and supplication in the Spirit. Pray always with prayer and supplication in the Spirit. Pray always with prayer and supplication in the Spirit. Pray always with prayer and supplication in the Spirit. Pray always with prayer and supplication in the Spirit. Pray always with prayer and supplication in the Spirit. Pray always with prayer and supplication in the Spirit. Pray always with prayer and supplication in the Spirit. Pray always with prayer and supplication in the Spirit. Pray always with prayer and supplication in the Spirit. Pray always with prayer and supplication in the Spirit. Pray always with prayer and supplication in the Spirit. Pray always with prayer and supplication in the Spirit. Pray always with prayer and supplication in the Spirit. Pray always with prayer and supplication Si no estás dando el culto de oración, debes de venir. We have young men that pray as you've never heard prayer. As you should have heard it, but never heard it. Ah, you should have 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 heard it. Praying, you can force your mind to listen to each request. It won't be easy. The devil will try to stop you. Not once, not twice, but in every prayer meeting, the devil will be there to pull your mind so you won't listen to the person who's giving the request. For he knows that your participation in that prayer will make it powerful against him. 魔鬼知道，一旦你真心的、全心全意投入了祷告会，就成为强大的力量与他作对。When someone else is praying, force your mind to listen carefully to each request. 当别人带头领导的时候，你要真正的强迫自己思维去聆听。Quando otro ora di scuccia con cuidado. And as the leader prays, at the end of each request. Say amen. 带头祷告说，每个结束的时候呢，就说阿门。What what what is the thing? Amen. That makes the leader's prayer your prayer, and you're not just sitting there wasting time. 这就是带头者的请求成为你的祷告了。That's what the Lord said. The leader said, "Oh, the Lord." That makes your prayer a mighty force against Satan. 就使得我们的祷告有强大的力量与撒旦作对。
And our main prayer must be always and forever for God to come down in our work with His presence. And that his presence would flow down and become a mighty revival among us. Oh, that thou wouldest rend the heavens! That thou wouldest come down! That thou wouldest come down that the mountains might flow down at thy presence! When God comes down among us, the mountains flow down at His presence. Mountains of unbelief flow down. Mountains of doubt flow down. Mountains of jealousy flow down. Mountains that separate us one from another flow down at His presence. And deep love for each other flows down at His presence. Mountains that stand against our God and His Christ flow down like molten lava from a volcano. Flow down in revival. And I charge you, young people, to pray hard and every day for the presence of God to come down among us in a great and mighty revival. Turn your weekly prayer meetings in small groups into prayer for revival at all sides of it and nothing else. Nothing else will do. For revival prayer means taking hold of God and praying like Jacob. That's what I will not let thee go except thou bless me. As Dr. Light Jones said, taking hold of God, pleading with God, reasoning with God, beseeching God, for it is only when the Christian prays like that that he is praying revival prayer. I recognize that there are some here who do not want us to pray for revival. You may think that last year's touch of revival didn't do us much good. But you are wrong. Last year, we only had a touch of revival. And really, only two days. And only two days. Look what happened as a result. John Kagan had been resisting. John Kagan of But in that touch of revival, he surrendered to preach the gospel, and we have a new pastor because of that tiny touch of revival. Furthermore, we got Aaron Yancey. An amazing young man. Noah Song. Who preaches, who preaches and sings and gets people saved two of them last Sunday night. 
他先到中间一个未年轻，上礼拜结束。问题大，好的，我看过了，我怎么上？ And Jack Nang, I say Yang Guohui. Jack Nang, outstanding man. Any one of the three of them, Aaron, Noah, or Jack, could pastor a church. These seven men can do it all in the job. What can I do with me? Aaron, Noah, Jack, they're not so damn good. You got all three of them from that tiny touch of revival. Just in that rising rising, those two days, we got these seven men. Three of them are the ones who do the movement. Next fall in November. Next fall in November. Next fall in November. As a result of that tiny touch of revival, we will baptize more people than we have ever baptized since we became the Baptist Tabernacle of Los Angeles. Three times as many. Three times as many. Three times as many. Three times as many. Try it sometime. And where did all those converts come from? They came from that small touch of revival that God sent us last summer. That's where they came from. Sing the second stanza again. As you remain seated. Second strophe. Service last year, I told you that we had only had a touch of revival. 去年当我们停止那系列复兴的时候，我们对你们讲不过尝到一点点滋味。Al fin del tiempo de avivamiento el año pasado dije que solo era un toque. But I said then, and I say again tonight, this morning, we may well have a great outpouring this year. 但今天讲话再次重复，今天今年可能会有强大的神的这个圣灵的倾泻的。Dije entonces te lo digo de nuevo que será gran derramamiento este año. From sixty years of Preaching and seeing firsthand three revivals that that Baptist preachers would be astonished at, uh, that because they were not charismatic, they were real revival. And I've seen three of them. Most pastors have never seen one. It's a great privilege. I in my life saw three great revivals. The rest of them I've never seen. In 60 years, I've seen three revivals. Great privilege because I've never seen any of them. And we hear some men say the age of revivals is past. It is wrong in this dispensation to pray for an outpouring of God's Spirit. But I know by sixty years of experience that they are wrong. I know by experience that you can have a touch of revival before you have a gully washer, and that's usually the way it happens. I know that you must have a touch of revival before you have a gully washer, and that's usually the way it happens. I know that you must have a touch of revival before you have a gully washer, and that's usually the way it happens. I know that you must have a touch of revival before you have a gully washer, and that's usually the way it happens. I know that you must have a touch of revival before you have a gully washer, and that's usually the way it happens. It does so much for the church. Then more people say it may happen again, and more prayer, and God will send the gully washer that will change our church forever. 
and make it the great church that it ought to be. I have seen three revivals already in my lifetime. And because of that, I know, I know that we can have it again in our church. I know that putting these young men in leadership. Will not save our church. Somebody said, Are you so naive that you think if you put these young men in charge that it will save the church? No, I am not that naive. No, I know that that alone will not change our church. Not only that, they cannot even strengthen the church. Nor as a result will we even see a new New Baptist Tabernacle. Unless God pours down His Spirit among us. Then and only then will we have the new Baptist Tabernacle. Among us. Oh, that thou wouldest rend the heavens, that thou wouldest come down, that the mountains might flow down at thy presence. Number three, old time power by a man that knew what old time power was. Paul Rader, when Paul Rader was pastor of Moody Church, he saw revival and we can today. Number three. We
to find fault with our charismatic and Pentecostal brothers. 并不是为了挑剔那些灵音派的朋友。Some of whom have been very precious to me in times of of darkness. 在你黑暗时刻，很多朋友是很非常亲密的。Algunos de ellos me han ayudado mucho en tiempos de oscuridad. But there's a tendency there to mistake emotion for revival. 但是很多人呢，把那个情感冲动作为复兴。I do not say that it's true of all, but it is true of many. 很多这样。Hay tendencia de confundir emoción con avivamiento. We had best go back and learn of real revival. 我们要回去找到真正的复兴是什么 ？Mejor mire el avivamiento real. Jonathan Edwards, the theologian of revival forever. 愿那大爱德华这样讲。Jonathan Edwards, the great avivamiento. George Whitfield, the preacher of revival forever. These things did not begin at Azusa Street. They began long before that among the Puritans and among the preachers of the First Great Awakening. These things did not begin at Azusa Street. They began long before that among the Puritans and among the preachers of the First Great Awakening. These things did not begin at Azusa Street. They began long before that among the Puritans and among the preachers of the First Great Awakening. These things did not begin at Azusa Street. They began long before that among the Puritans and among the preachers of the First Great Awakening. What I am proposing here this morning is the old definition of revival: power and life from God Himself, not gibberish. 今早我讲的就是古典古时的那种复兴，并不是那些垃圾。Lo que estoy diciendo es poder de Dios, no la basura de los contenidos. And my dear friends, true revival always has the hallmark stamp of Jesus Christ. Being central in every service, in every prayer, in everything. If Christ is not present, if He's relegated to the background, and the Holy Spirit is brought to the front, it is counterfeit revival. If we don't have Jesus as the center of the service, we're not going to have the revival. Jesus is not in the forefront of the false movement. For long years and long decades. The churches have languished without revival. 这么多世纪以来，这么多这几十年来，我们教会没有复兴中间，已经完全沉沦下。For a long time, the Iglesia de Angai has struggled to sing a vision. Until at last, good men said, "The age of revivals is past." 直到最后，连好的那个善人都这样讲说，复兴的时代过去了。The age will go out in the blackness of apostasy. 结果，整个的世纪，整个世界的历史会在黑暗中间结束。There is no hope of God repeating Pentecost in the last days. 在末世中，再不可能有五旬节那个神就重复了。No esperanza de Dios repitiendo Pentecostés en los últimos días. But I know they're wrong. 但我知道他们错。But I said they're wrong. How do I know? 他我怎么知道 ？I saw. 我见过。Yo vi. With my own eyes. 亲眼见过。Con mis ojos. A tiny Chinese church have two thousand members come in within a two-year period. I saw that. Two years. That cannot be counteracted. I have seen the videos of what's happening in China. I have seen the videos of what's happening in China. China is the poster boy of revival. Because how can it be that there are no revivals? How can it be that we are secessionists, as John MacArthur is? He can be a secessionist, but they never heard of that in China. So they go right on having huge revivals with millions of people coming in. They never heard of secessionism. 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 Uh, I do not hate John MacArthur, not at all. No, dear John MacArthur. I read his commentary. I, I sometimes quote his commentary. But I asked Dr. Kagan last night. Dr. Kagan was a member of his church for over a year. Attended every service. 昨天晚上问凯根博士，他曾做麦克阿瑟博士成员两年。Let me tell you, Doctor Kagan, that he has been a member of the church for a long time. Somebody let E and H Murray see this video. 
I want, I want E.N.H. Murray to see this video. And I asked Dr. Kagan, who's a very studious man with two PhDs, the second one in religion. I said to him, Doctor, you were in Dr. MacArthur's church for a year every Sunday. Do you think that his teaching can ever produce revival? Well, here is Dr. Kagan, and I'll let him answer it. Will that kind of Bible teaching, verse by verse, will that, can that be used in revival? No, that can never be used in revival. Now I don't I don't mean to correct uh Ian H. Murray. How could I do that? He's a man that's older than me. I consider him to be a great man of God. But I would say to him, because he has put out a book on MacArthur, he's put out a second book with MacArthur as the last chapter, and I would say to Mr. Murray, who's a godly good man, except those days be shortened, the very elect will be deceived. My dear friends, Jesus Christ died on the cross to pay the penalty for your sin. Jesus Christ shed his precious blood on that cross to wash away your sin. Jesus Christ has risen from the dead, is risen from the dead. He's in another dimension in the third heaven. Seated at the right hand of God. Praying for you. Only trust him. Only trust him. Only trust him now. He will save you. He will save you. He will save you now. Amen. Please stand together. And I will ask Mr. Prudholm to pray for the men that we are going to ordain and license. Father, we thank thee for thy mercies, for thy grace upon us. We thank thee for the touch of revival that thou gave us and the effects thereof. And we ask thee, O God, that thou would bless this work, that thou would bless these beginnings. We ask that thou would breathe upon us and that thou would be in the midst of this. Grant thy blessing upon these men who are being ordained. Grant thy blessing upon our church that takes this turn. We ask that thou wouldst move us by thy spirit. Breathe upon us. Help us to pray. Help us to regard what we heard today. And be thou in our midst, O God. Grant us a movement of thy spirit. Thou who hast come and begun, finish what thou hast begun, we ask. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Now, you may be seated. We will close this service by taking a photograph. We'll take many more photographs uh, in the actual ordination and so forth. But I thought it would be good for us to have a, a photograph of the day when Dr. Keimers, the founder of the church, uh, told you who's going to be done, what's going to be done to each one. We'll leave this on the tape. We'll leave this on the video. Some of you take a good shot up there. And I would like to have the next pastor of our church, John Samuel Kagan, come and stand here, please.
，下一任的我们的牧师约翰·夏缪·凯根到下面一同照相。John Samuel Kagan. And I would like to have his parents come. Please, be, please uh, don't stand. It'll make it uh, impossible. Come, Dr. Kagan and Mrs. Kagan, come. And, and Grandma, come on. Bring her. Abuela. Start moving now. So she can be in the picture. Amen. Julie, come here. You can be seated now. You can be seated. And this girl is his fiance. Stand right beside him. All right. Okay. Amen. Noah's song will be uh, licensed to the ministry. The parents come down, please. Quick. Brother, brother, come. And I would never forget what his brother said. His brother said when, when Noah decided to be a preacher, his brother said to me, his mouth was open, I said, what's the matter? He said, I never thought my brother would be a preacher. Yeah, amen, he is, he's a good one. He look, he's beginning to look like John's son. <laughs> Now let me see if this looks right. All right, come here, brother, come here. Kneel, turn around this way, kneel down on, on the floor. You can do it. <laughs> turn around and do obeisance to your brother. No. <laughs> yes, amen, thank you, boys, thank you, girls. One more, right now, right now. You're missing it, wake up. And now these men that are going to be ordained as deacons and will have a rotating deacon board, the chairman, of, the permanent chairman of the deacons, Mr. Yancey. <laughs> and Mr. Uh, Mr. Jack Nang, just remain standing there. Jack Nang, please. And you're, let's, oh, let's move over that way a little bit. Jack Nang, and move over out of the picture, yeah. That's it, the back of the bus for you. All right. <laughs> Where's your wife at? Come here. Mrs. Nang, are you here? Oh, there you are. Yes, stand on this side, on the other side of it. The Yangs have two boys, but they're, uh, the Nangs have two boys, but they're a little bit small to get down, down here. All right, thank you. Stand over there with him. Jack, wait, Jack Nang, who did I miss? Abel Prudholm. What? What? Oh, come here, come here, come here, guy. Come here, guy, I forgot, you're so ugly, I forgot you were married. <laughs> and he's got a cute little wife. Isn't she nice? I like her very much. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry about that. Uh, now, uh, Abel Prudholm, he's been a, he's been a, a, um, a cooking deacon. He's been being cooked for three or four years, and I think we should ordain him. Come on down here. Please.
Mrs. Poulon, where are you? Yeah, but wait a minute, let's have a couple pictures here. He's... Okay, Abel Jr., come here, stand right here. If you hurry up and grow a little bit, we'll have to have you stand on the side. He's about 23, you know. <laughs> he's, he's, he's a late bloomer like me. I'm just blooming now. Late bloomer. All right. Wait, 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 over here. All right, and um, Q Dong Lee. Where's his wife? Where's your wife? Oh, there you are. Oh, yeah, there you are right in front of me with a black dress on. You look very nice. Deacons, come up here, make a row across here, stand up on the first thing there. Come down here, John, and leave the little space here in between. John and Noah, come down here, please. And the other, okay, you other deacons, you've been, stand here, down here. And stand here, and Mrs. Heimers, come with me up here. And Mrs. Heimers is the mother of our church. Move in closer, yeah, a little closer, yeah. I almost lost my bridge work. I was preaching. <laughs> Slipped in and out. I don't have false teeth, but I do have a bridge. And it almost came out. I forgot to glue it in. I was thought I was just going to read it, you know. And you know me, I can't just read a sermon. I have to preach it. Amen. Cut that part out where I put my bridge back in. Do they look good? Let me look here. Let me just have a peek at them here and see if they look good or not. Yeah, I guess I guess they can't change them too much. All right. Amen. All right. Yeah, they look they look good. How could they look bad? Shadow John. Shadow John. One more, una mas. All right, let's stand together. This is not the usual way we do church. This is unusual today. Once in a lifetime. Now, these people that you've seen here, will, this will happen, they'll, they'll be ordained and licensed and so forth in November. And I think we'll have almost 20 people. And I propose that we uh, ordain John as pastor and let him baptize 20 people. Amen. Is the new, new Baptist Tabernacle. Heavenly Father, we pray that thou wilt bless the food that we're about to have and our time of fellowship together. We thank thee for thy graciousness and thy love toward us. And we pray that thou wilt make the Baptist Tabernacle of Los Angeles an even greater light in this darkened time. Amen. We ask in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. I'm going to party upstairs in about three minutes.
allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all.